Question 16. Calculate 465 multiplied by 52. Now this is going to be a long multiplication question. Now there's a couple of ways you can do this. A couple of different methods you might have learned. First of all, I'm going to do the magic zero method. Now then, magic zero method, you need to set it out properly first. So we've got 465 multiplied by 52. And you need three lines in which to do your working out. Okay, so here we go. First line, we're going to do the 465 multiplied by this 2. So we're going to do 2 lots of 5, 2 lots of 6, 2 lots of 4 in that order. 2 5s, 2 6s, 2 4s. So 2 5s are 10, put your 0 in, carry your 1 to the next column. 2 6s are 12, plus 1 is 13, carry the 1 to the next column. 2 4s are 8, plus 1 is 9. Now the second line, we've dealt with the 2, so now we need to deal with this 5. So we're going to times everything by this 5, but this 5 doesn't just mean 5, it's in the tens column. This 5 actually represents 50. So to multiply by 50, you put your magic 0 in and then just multiply everything by 5. So if, and that has the same effect as multiplying by 50. So 5 5s, 5 6s, 5 4s in that order. 5 5s, 5 6s, 5 4s. So 5 5s are 25, put the 5 in, carry the 2. 5 6s are 30, plus the 2 is 32, carry the 3. 5 4s are 20, plus the 3 is 23. That makes 23,250. Now on the final line, all we've got to do is add these two answers together. Because remember, the blue answer is 2 lots of 465, and the purple answer is 50 lots of 465. Add the two together, and we'll have 52 lots of 465, which is what we're looking for. Before you do this adding, it's a good idea just to cross out anything that you've already carried and already used because we're not wanting to add that in by accident so now we just need to add these two numbers together so 0 plus 0 is 0 3 plus 5 is 8 9 plus 2 is 11 carry the 1 3 plus 1 is 4 and then there's just 2 on the end so that's 24,180 so the answer is 24,180 now some of you may have learned something called the grid method now the grid method would look something like this. Be interested to see if we get the same answer. So we're doing a three digit number multiplied by a two digit number, so we need a three by two grid. So let's break the 465 down into 460 and 5 and break the 52 down into 50 and 2. So when we are multiplying, this top left box is 50 times 400. Well, 5 times 4 is 20, and then we've got 1, 2, 3 zeros to put on the end. 1, 2, 3 extra zeros. This box is 50 times 60. 5 sixes are 30, and then we've got 1, 2 extra zeros, so that makes 3,000. And this box is 5 times 50. Well, 5 times 5 is 25, and then we've got 1 extra zero here, which goes on the end there. So all together on the top line, we've got 23,250 23,250 now we need to do a similar thing for the bottom line so 2 lots of 400 is 800 2 lots of 60 is 120 2 lots of 5 is 10 add all of the bottom line together so 800 plus 120 is 920 plus 10 is 930 set this out ready for a call method Guess what's coming? We just need to add these two lines together, the top line and the bottom line, and then we'll have the total of everything, and we will see if it matches our answer. So 0 plus 0 is 0, 5 plus 3 is 8, 2 plus 9 is 11, put your 1 in, carry your 1, 3 plus 1 is 4, then we've got the 2 on its own there, so that's 2. So the final answer is 24,180. Now, obviously, the good news is that that matches what we got down here, therefore it must be the correct answer.